Hey guys, welcome back to another game of Legend of Runeterra. This time we are playing a Senna only deck. Senna uses the same principle as Vega. By that I mean she is fully focused on darkness. Darkness is a spell card that has the effect of dealing 2 damage to a unit. When Senna is summoned, she will create a darkness in hand if she doesn't already have one. Uh, damage spell become uh, accelerated too fast instead of slow. If she is summoned and you kill three units or illusion die, she will evolve and damage uh, spells will cost one less. To maximize the effect, I put as many cards as possible that has the function of synergy. With either with darkness or spells that deal damage. I am going to start with two twisted catalyzer. When they strike, it will grant every darkness darkness everywhere, which means in hand or in field or in play, one extra damage. So after this time, all darkness will deal 4 damage instead of, of 2. We also have Stilted Rope Maker. Okay. I will let him attack. So, still the drop maker will reduce the cost of all darkness by one. So instead of costing three, it now costs two. Okay. As a buffer, I also put some cards that can help us uh, deal more damage or survive, like. Uh, Redeemed Prodigy, which will summon a ghastly band. It's an ephemeral hallowed unit. Hallowed means after it died for the rest of the game when Ali attack, hallow your first attacker, the one on the left, and granted plus one damage. Mm -hmm. So let's start to attack. If you use kindly, uh, kindly tavern maker, okay. I want to keep redeem protege longer, so I will save him. By dealing, by using undergrowth, which will toss three cards and drain, as in deal two damage to a, a unit and heal my nexus same amount. Now, tenor, tenor of terror will have the special effect of summoning bass of burden. Okay, let's summon Solari Until I am no more. of Sentinel. Okay, I know somebody in the comment is going to say I am an idiot for not killing. Earlier, but mm 
Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do it this way. It will allow me to deal a black spear when an ally dies. It will allow me to deal four damage to a unit. It will not kill mammoth shaman. He will still transform, but hopefully, but I can kill him with darkness. Because I am not sure if he will evolve after I will heal him or not. Okay, now I am going to attack again. And this time, darkness will be I will unite the even stronger. Okay, he summoned Ash. I am going to use Vengeance, which allow me to strike up, kill a unit. Mm -hmm. As a win condition, beside Senna, we also have this and other. I will take it. So since I add, I have twisted catalyst, if I summon Exeter Sentinel, it will allow me to summon a darkness and deal its damage to both the unit and the enemy nexus. So now I can use darkness to kill a unit in this case. Esmos, or whatever he is going to summon now, and deal 5 damage to the next. Uh -huh. Okay, I will do it either way. So, 5 damage to hit that stairs. Next round, I can finally summon this and other. The fact it is really powerful spell is because it will allow me, it will create darkness. And once I use it, it will deal the damage to all enemy units. And of course, this means I can attack for free. Okay, he has 1 HP. Let's see what he will summon next. And let's he summon she who wanders, which will obliterate all units with four or less damage, even in my hand. Apparently. But that's it. Hope you like this video. If you do, please share, subscribe, hit the notification button, and put in the comment what other champions you'd like to see next. Bye. Thank you.